Hello guys and welcome back to my channel for yet another part of Let's Play the SimCity Society's Destinations. We are on part number 13. Yeah, okay, okay. Do we agree? I think we do. Alright guys, so uh, where we previously left off, we had a lot going on. Um, somebody said that if we go and uh, basically click on the police stations and put in um, overtime, the... I guess from what I understood that they will send in like a SWAT team and round up all the um, round up all the criminals. I don't know if that's true, but I am going to go and see if indeed look at all these cop cars now. If indeed that this actually does happen. Are we on fast speed? Let's do it normal speed. I feel like sometimes days just go by a little too fast. So um, I don't know. We'll we'll totally uh, see kind of what happens. Look at how weird that looks. Like it's like not even attached to the ground. Period. This place was really, really, really way, way, way too um like bumpy and landscapey ish, if that made any sense. But here's another one. So we'll have him go and put in over time. Um, I think there is one downtown. So here's another one that we'll put an overtime on. See, we've got a lot of police stations. It's just for some reason, um, we got a lot of crime. And I think it is obviously because of the, the slums. And that's totally okay with me. Um, but, you know, we're just going to have to do a lot more to combat it, I guess. So uh, what is this old man? It's a pilgrim. We found a pilgrim contemplating the city. Look at all the people over playing um, baseball. How sweet. Where did it go? Jen doesn't know. Where did Jen? Where, Jen? Jen? Jen, where are you at? Where? Whoa. Where are you right now? Whoa. What's going on? Oh, jeez. I was like stuck there for a second. That was kind of a little bit of a little bit of a almost a titty twister, but I meant to say tongue twister. <laughs> Okay, I don't know where I, I, why I, what the hell is this? Why is it like t teleporting me places? Isn't that weird? Like I'm not doing it on purpose, but it's just happening anyway. I do have a video rendering, so like right now my computer might be just having a little bit of a heart attack. But look at this girl, she twerking, she twerking, she twerking it, and she working it. <laughs> so cute! Look at this guy with his arm posted up, and this girl looks like that girl. Very cute though. It says there are zero people here, but I don't know. Looks like there's a lot more than zero. Just saying. Anyways, um, I wanted to. Somebody was like, "Oh, hey, we should put a." Or I was having an issue. I was like, oh, what do I put on the island? You know, there's not a lot of room or whatever. This little island over here. I wanted to put something on it. And then um, somebody's like, why don't you just put a subway station there? A da, Jen. A da. Right? I know. Uh, it was brilliant. Brilliant idea. So now I just got to find the island. Am I like on the island? Where is the island? There's no more island? What happened to it? It was like right here. Oh, it's right over there. Okay, let's go over there. Whoop. Look, there goes the ship. Cool. Okay, so this is the island. Or here is another island, actually. Um, the other one that we were seeing before, I don't think it's here anymore. That is kind of weird. Actually, no, it's right there. This is it. Okay. And we could put a lot of different things here. I could have sworn it was just one little piece, though. It's just, there's like a lot of stuff we could probably put on this little island. So let's go ahead and check it out. You made 30 grand yesterday. Hell yeah. That's right. Because we be bossing and flossing. <laughs> okay, so let's go see what kind of cool stuff we could put on this little island. We could do an animal preserve, but I don't think we would fit that big guy on there. Um, an aquarium would be so much fun. But again, this little island's kind of small. But I do want to put maybe the aquarium next to this area here which is like a nice little resort town and I'm, I'm really liking the way that this looks a lot so i am going to probably put the aquarium like right in here maybe or right here i kind of liked the aquarium here to be more specific i actually really liked it here but i want to have enough room for the street to kind of go by so there we are. There's the aquarium. And I could just kind of drag the street from there over to the slum area. So then that way there's like just more um, room because this road gets used quite a bit anyways. And I don't think we are going to um, really be um, putting much else like right there, I guess is what I'm trying to say. I don't know. I guess I could just drag it here and then put like another little... Um, 
building right in there. So there we go. That's kind of what we got going on. It's very zigzaggy daggy, but it looks it looks pretty cool, and it'll give people a um, a better like route to take, I guess, instead of having to go all the way around. See, people are already using it. It's brilliant. So I don't think we have like a bus station or anything down here. Uh, we do have the water park and the little playground, and there's just like a lot of cool stuff going on down here. There's so much fun, uh, fun things to do. And for the aquarium, um, inside the most exotic aquatic animals are all on display for your citizens' enjoyment. Um, what else could we put in here? There's an art museum. There's the balloon cart. The balloon cart is kind of cute. Uh, I wonder if it'll fit like right here, maybe. I don't know. It's kind of neat. It's like a nice little place to go, but I'm probably sure we could fit next to the, um, playground. I don't know. This just looks random. It's like kind of random. What about right in here? Yep. There we go. We'll have a balloon cart right there. Oh, never mind. That, no, no, definitely not. No, 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 no. We'll go ahead and delete that. That doesn't look good at all, but I actually really like this resort area. It's really, really nice. Um, I want to see if we can. Are you not going to delete for me? Somebody ain't listening. Somebody ain't listening. Okay, there we go. Um, let me find out if there's anything that we can do for the resort. Resort affiliation. We can affiliate the bistro, I guess. Um, we're going to affiliate the, uh, the water park. And then I think if we can affiliate more things too gonna probably affiliate the um this little bistro thing too as well so get uh, glittering and shimmering sands blah 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 resort affiliation affiliate venue with this resort allowing your resort visitors to benefit from the venue so pretty cool uh okay travelers visiting this receiving one adventure per day modified by oh that's cool Oh, right. Um, this resort is not providing any worship satisfaction. Ah, got it. This resort, resort is not providing any. Oh, Jennifer forgets it now. I can't reach all the way over there to do the casino, though. That's the issue. It's too far away. Okay, what else could we do? What else could we affiliate it with? Um, what's this? What is this? It's the pub. Okay, cool. So uh, the, res the resort is affiliated with this pub as well. Um, so we got four-star restaurant. Okay, no entertainment. And this is a condo complex? The bed and breakfast? I don't know. But for right now, um, we got a couple things that the resort affiliates with. So now people are actually starting to come here, which is kind of cool. So... Um, I like that actually. Now let me go over here and see because this is a casino resort, correct? If I'm not, um, if I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, I wonder if we can uh, affiliate anything with this. No, okay. Well, there's actually quite a bit of people here. Now, let's see. We need to have more people. Angry, oh, angry vacationers. What? Get out of town! Like literally, get out of town! I am making so much money. Ha ha ha! Income from gambling. Um, 17 grand. I'm only losing two grand a day. And there's just like a big population. Now, I want to see what kind of disasters we can do. We could do a killer storm. Should we do the killer storm? I'm going to do the killer storm. It's going to be killer. <laughs> you ready? <gasps> All right. I think we could. I mean, we have a lot of money. So I'm going to say let's start a killer storm. Oh, here it goes. The killer storm is happening. Um, okay. I don't know what's going to happen. A building has collapsed. These are some four. Oh, there's a fire, you guys. Ah, there's a fire. Oh, my goodness. But it's raining, so I don't understand. Oh, a building has collapsed. We're getting a lot of collapsed buildings. Oh, my goodness. Look at the storm. It's, like, really interesting. There's so much rain and fire. Board up your windows. Hunker down. A storm is coming, and it's likely to take a fair number of buildings in our city with it. So we've got... Okay, we got a fire. This building has collapsed oh my gosh this is so freaking cool um at least we have a, a a doctor or not doctor but at least we have a few medical people i just can't see it because these lights keep blinking i'm like having a panic attack oh my gosh so many buildings have collapsed i want this to be over look at all this stuff that's happening um recording studio like everything is getting affected right now citizens battle down the hatches and prepare for the incoming storm 
Oh my gosh, okay. All right, well, maybe the storm is over now. I think the storm, I think the storm's over. Okay, that was really cool. There was a lot going on though, that is for sure. There's, okay, 32 hours remaining. It looks like the house is actually getting built back up, which is cool. Um, this building got destroyed. So we've got a lot of interesting things going on right now. We've got minus 99 on the, oh my God, so many buildings, so many buildings. So, so, so many have been, um, have been basically knocked down. And this, what is this? The track mansion. Oh, it's disabled. It's still burning. We have 30 hours remaining, you guys. Wow, what a huge, 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 huge storm. Zimbabwe begins recovering from the storm. Cash damages are estimated 98 grand. Net reference trash the bowling alley? Where do you mean they trash the bowling alley? What do you mean they're trashing the bowling alley? Why would you do that? Oh my god, no, click to go to the building. I'm trying, but I don't see the bowling alley. Oh, there it is, okay. Oh my god, this killer storm is back? Oh my god, a tropical storm has shut down airports and water transportation. Oh my god, oh my god. Now we have another freaking storm. This is insane, you guys. There's just so much going on. Okay, guys, so, um... I don't know what happened, but my game like totally froze or not froze, but like stopped responding. So basically, um, we are kind of picking up where we left off and we have yet the other, the second round of storms kind of coming through. All these buildings are damaged. A lot of things are going on um, and hopefully we can just survive the storm. I'm not going to start like repairing things until this next batch of freaking storms, um, you know, like blows over, I guess. So right now all transportation to our ports and things like that are damaged. Um, these homes are damaged. A lot of like the, uh, um, almost all of, look, like, look at our ferry, our seaport. It's completely, completely damaged. It's, um, not even fixable, it looks like. So we'd have to kind of repair the seaport, I think. But again, I'm just going to wait until the storm is over and it looks like we're going to be forking out about a hundred grand or so to fix all of the damages. Like this villa is completely uh, destroyed. This is completely destroyed. This building has been destroyed. Um, so these are all the things that we're going to have to kind of rebuild on. So that'll be interesting. I actually, I actually kind of like that a little bit. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to, this definitely, this storm or whatever has had more damage than the earthquake, like the earthquake barely did anything. And as you can see, we are negative 162 prosperity, um, prosperity, prosperity points. So that's unfortunate. We got a lot of stuff kind of shut down right now, but we're just kind of waiting out this storm and it looks like people are moving out, um, because this house is on freaking fire. It's just, it's definitely a lot of a lot of drama going on. Look at this home. It's like floating in midair. This looks like some Minecraft business. I don't know. I think someone's sick and died. Probably should open up a hospital. Now, if we go and check and see uh, all the sick Sims, all the injured Sims. There's so many injuries. Oh, my God. So many injuries. So many injuries. So many sick Sims right now. Um, illnesses, natural deaths accidental deaths there's been seven accidental deaths wow all right uh we probably could put in a hospital but i don't think we could actually like afford well i'm not sure if we can afford one right now but um it's more or less like okay i think the oh my god look at how much damage this place took out like it took out so many of these buildings. We almost had a five-star resort. A lot of six sims going on. So let's get a hospital in here or something. Um, I don't know how much it's going to cost me, but we are going to, uh, you know, see whatever we can afford. Now, I don't know if we have a major uh, trauma center. It will treat 40 people. We could actually have one, but I'm probably going to put one. I don't know if we have one, do though. We have this one. Yeah, this is the major. This is the the trauma center, isn't it? Or no? Well, I know what it looks like, so it shouldn't be too hard to find it. Um, that might be the trauma center. I think it is. I don't really know. Well, another one won't hurt. And there's a lot of six Sims running around town. So I'm assuming that probably we don't have um, one in here. But I'm going to put one, like, right here, maybe. Okay, let's do it right there. Or 
we can put it in let's see actually I would probably prefer to put one downtown because I, I could imagine like that's where a lot of it would be so we're still kind of waiting for things to pick back up and um, for everything to kind of resume to what it was I'm actually gonna put this I know we need to fix the prosperity, but it shouldn't be an issue, actually. <gasps> There's a ski resort, you guys. A freaking ski resort. Oh, my goodness. Ah, I want one. Okay. Let's look up the... I remember there was a way to filter it, and I, like, already forgot. Like, I already forgot. Like, how do you forget? I don't know. I did, though. I definitely... I definitely forgot. Um, There's the skyscraper. That will get us... So if we put in a couple skyscrapers and financial buildings, that should be able to pick us back up. And we should be able to recover from this just fine. There's going to be a lot of um, combing through the uh, combing through the city and seeing what needs to be replaced and what can be fixed and all that jazz. But uh, it's definitely going to take up a lot of work. It's going to take up a lot of work for sure. Look at this poor guy. He's all hurt and like, oh my gosh. I need to put it in a street though right here. We'll be able to recover, I promise. That was just a lot of fun. Like, I know it's, it's mass destruction, but you can't deny that. That was somewhat a little exciting. A little bit. All right. So let's go put in this skyscraper right here. Um, put in one of those. Now we are at 46 points. We can go ahead and do an oil refinery, but this one um, will provide its corporate. It reduces happiness, but it really, 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 really... Um, helps out getting some more cash which obviously we need so i'm gonna put in this oil refinery and then somebody said put it in and put in an insane asylum um i'm thinking about doing that too so i i don't know where to put this oil refinery we have a lot of uh a lot of i'm actually gonna probably put it right here for now you know i know we need the oh now we need a certain amount of productivity ah okay so if i i forgot how to filter you guys are gonna kick my butt but uh I forgot how to filter this out. I totally did. And it wasn't hard. Like, it really, really wasn't hard. But I totally forgot how to do it. Shoot. Do you, like, click this? Okay, wait, wait, wait. You open this. Right. And then you click it. No, no, that's not. No. <gasps> there we go. I think that's how you do it. Something like that. Okay. Um, okay, I don't really know exactly. But we're going to go with it. So I need a 17... Um, of these little productivity thingy-majiggers. Um, now if I click this and hit that, maybe it'll show me some? No. Any of these produce any productivity? We can add in some tenements. Woodsman hut. Oh, this one could have caused a lot of fire, but it is a private location. We would need 17 of those. Now the housing projects. This produces a lot of crime, and we really just can't even afford any more crime right now. Um, but this is unattractive building, high chance of becoming ill, tenements, but it does actually produce some workers. So what I'm thinking is probably putting in some tenements like right here, which is, I know it's kind of a bad place to put them. It's very unfortunate. That is for sure. But, um, we're going to put some in like all like row them out right here. So now we've got these tenements and I'm going to probably put in a couple more behind the um behind uh, behind the uh places back here too i know it's just like it's kind of random but that's what i'm doing so hopefully it'll work out we do have a bus stop right there so people are able to travel back and forth and then we're only negative one creativity point which is so exciting or product i just call it creativity because of the freaking diamond like i don't know it just looks like creative to me i, I don't know i don't know i don't know don't judge me don't judge me um i really want that freaking ski resort you like have no idea oh my god oh it can only build if a snowy mountain exists that sucks that's like you got me all excited for nothing for absolutely oh jeweler <gasps> oh jen's getting all excited we have a lot to do though guys i really need to get this um this kind of work in here okay there we go that makes sense i only need one so i'm gonna do a barbecue pit here in the tenement so that's what's gonna happen right there just put in a couple barbecue pits make people somewhat happy i guess even though i don't know how you could be happy living in the slums like like this this is bad this is like really really bad but there's some fun things to do though so i mean at least you kind of got you know you really sad to eat a hot show life should be a little bit better for you i don't know um, let me see what time it is. So I 
think what else can we do um well we got all these other buildings that are really damaged and so you know i mean it, sh it should be better i think it should be better i think it'll be better eventually um we just gotta kind of be patient i know that for sure some of these things down here like the villa and the port like this is this is completely destroyed, so we're going to have to, like, buy a new one. And hopefully we can buy a new one. I am going to look and see if it is possible to replace that seaport, which which really would have sucked if we didn't have the money to do that, but we do. So we're going to we're gonna replace the seaport. We've got, um, uh, let's see what else we got going on here that's been destroyed. We have the bungee jump. That's been destroyed, but I mean, I would, I kind of want to put in something a little bit different than the bungee jump because it's, it's just been there for a while, but let's just go through really quick and kind of pick off these buildings. Um, and then that just gives us more like a better, um, more of a clean slate to kind of work with. I don't think that's broken. I just think it's closed. Anything else that we see? Cause I don't really know what else has been destroyed. What, what building was this? I don't know. All right. Well, I guess I'm just going to delete it. And I think I accidentally deleted part of the street too. That, that makes that makes perfect freaking sense. So as long as it's been um, completely demolished, then I'm going to delete them. Okay, that's been done. I wonder if we have homeless people now because of everything that happened. Oh, my God. It's kind of cool, though, actually. I actually like that this happened in a really weird, odd way because it gives us an opportunity to build again, like build starting over. You know what I mean? If you guys see any other buildings that are destroyed and demolished and I'm missing, totally let me know because I could use an extra set of eyes in this case. Like this little building is still totally done. Uh, the state fair was one of those ones. Oh, looks like, I don't know what that is. A hacienda maybe got demolished. I'm not, I'm not hundred percent sure. Um, but I think we'll be okay. You know, it was a big one. That is for sure. That was a huge freaking storm. I can't believe that was worse than the, Earthquake, and I think the reason why that was worse than the earthquake, though, is because of the location of the earthquake. The earthquake, um, the location wasn't that serious, so. Okay, what I need to do now is I think I got most of them. I'm probably missing a few in here somewhere. I wouldn't doubt it, but I do need to go and kind of repair some of these city streets that I may have deleted, and I'm probably going to miss them because I don't even remember where exactly those city streets were like this one here i just don't want to get anybody trapped or block anyone off that's kind of like the biggest thing right now so i'm gonna go ahead and put that in there we go there's a little porta potty fixing z streets and i think there was one more that may have happened i'm actually gonna can i put that right there um it's really 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 beautiful day that i actually here in the neighborhood now if you guys see where the other street went because i already forgot let me know let me know um yeah i don't i don't know where the other one was i'm sure i'll find it though i don't think it was over here i think it was like more over here someplace do 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 i don't know guys i'm not you know i'm not seeing it but if you see it let me know where it is because then i can fix it because i can't i can't find it right this minute oh it's right there okay cool all right, that was easy enough. Okay, so we've got um, the machine shop and this board of directors, which looks really awesome. Um, it's a minus 20 on the uh, prosperity, so we're going to have to actually put in a little work for this one, but this is such a freaking cool building that I cannot skip out on it. Now, I think there is room, too, so I might be able to put that like, right. It's actually a really big building. I wasn't anticipating that. Um, I could probably put it right here. So there we go. We got the board of directors building. That one's a really nice one. Um, and we've got kind of, a, not a lot of unhappy people, but quite a few unhappy people right now. Actually, to be honest with you, we really didn't, um, the corporate retreat. What's this? Uh, congratulations. Zimbabwe is now worthy of a corporate retreat. There's a TV network. Very cool. Adds in some creativity or in the city, there will be some celebrities and local productivity. Uh, definitely one that you would kind of want because if you put it in here in the city heart, uh, there could be a lot of, um, good that comes out of that because there's just so many corporate stuff that, that happens down here. So I'm gonna see if there's any room. All right, cool. We'll put it right there. So there we are. We have our own little TV and network. 
and we're going to be able to hopefully look at that eighteen thousand dollars like three we got three thousand more from it because of the multinational headquarters corporate one board of direction so i mean we're kind of we're kind of hustling targeted retail building for advertisements on tv making it more attractive for sure well, i wonder if we can do the the uh resort that would be really cool if we could do the resort i don't think we can though okay so that's fine but let's do what is this i don't know but we're gonna do this this is the mega mall absolutely totally um it says the destination for pilgrims of the consumer culture who have money <laughs> i don't know why these pilgrims are complaining we do stuff for them too anyways guys i hope you enjoyed this part um don't forget to go and comment rate, and subscribe let me know what y'all think in the comments down below where the uh, sun doesn't shine and i will see you all next time bye guys <laughs>